Hello everyone, this is Danny from the Cisco Tech Switching Team. Today, I want to show you how to convert your boot mode from bundle to install. These procedures are the same for all Catalyst 9000. I want to explain quickly what is install mode. Install mode is a newer and Cisco recommended mode to run. You use the packages.com file to boot. It breaks the bin file into smaller PKG files that must be loaded into memory, independently of each other, which allows you to boot faster and utilize memory better. However, it doesn't support boot from USB flash or TFTP. You need to access to the switch. Once you're prompt, verify the current boot mode. You can do it in three different ways. The show ROM pipe include boot system. You see that the boot system points to the bin file which means that bundle mode is used. On show boot, it is indicated that the current boot variable and the boot variable in a reload points to the bin file as well. Last but not least, show version. Here you notice that the system image file uses the bin file. Also at the bottom, you see the word bundle as bundle mode. Remember, on install mode, you boot by using the packages.com file. It is very important that you check what package file the .com file is pointed to, before to do a reload to ensure it is pointed to the correct ones. First, verify that you have the packages.com file starting the flash. To validate the .com file, you perform a more packages.com. If you scroll down, you see all the PKG files. Make sure that they correspond to your current Cisco iOS version. Now, to convert from bundle to install, you need to go to config mode. Reset the boot environment variable and configure the new variable, which in this case is packages.com. Save the changes. And to conclude the process, it is necessary to reload the switch. Once the reload has finished, prompt to the switch and verify the new boot mode. You use the same commands that were used to begin with. You can notice now that the boot system points to the packages.com. On show boot system, you see now that the current boot variable and boot variable in next reload is packages.com. And finally, on show version, now the system image uses the packages.com file. Also at the bottom, you see the word install as install mode. In case that packages.conf is not on the flash memory or doesn't correspond to the current Cisco iOS version, the procedure will be different. First, verify which is the iOS version you want to boot. Go to config mode and receive the boot environment variable. And configure the boot variable as packages.conf. Save the changes. And to add the packages.conf file to the flash, the operate command will be needed. On this step, you have to point to the bin file that corresponds to the Cisco iOS version desired. As you can see, it is indicated that the package has been added. Confirm that the boot config was changed to packages. It shows that package is activated, and you can see now the PKG files. At this point, a reload is necessary. Confirm that you want to proceed with it. Once the switch reloads, confirm that package has been added to the flash.
and the boot mode now is installed. At this point, you have successfully changed the boot mode from bundle to install. Don't hesitate to contact that support if you have any other doubt. And check the tag video portal for more. Thanks for the time you took to watch this video.